the way animation works is either the faster you play back the frames, the faster something appears to move. Now, seeing as we're going to keep the frame rate the same, um, how do you think you would make something move faster or slower? You would move it in... Yeah, move it more. Yeah, it's really quite simple. So, say you want him to move really slowly. You're going to want to obviously move, um, move him very small increments frame by frame at a time. And that will give very smooth motion. Now, if you want him to move faster, it's really simple. You just have him moving in bigger increments. Although, keep in mind, you still want to make sure you have enough frames in between. Otherwise, it appears it's moving just way too fast, and you can't see what's happening. So, say... picture, and now we can go back and forth, which helps, so now I can see exactly how much the character has moved. I'm going to do it again. So, I really... Now, what you want to do is when you've finished your animation, the way this works is there's things called markers, and what you do is that tells you what you want to, um, what part of the frames you want to play back, because you'll find there's quite a few pictures on here. So you hold it down to get rid of them all, you press it once on the first frame, which is the first um, picture, and then you go to the very end, and the last one, and then you play it back, which is really, so as you can see, it just moves back really simply. So there's nothing much to it, really, once you get the hang of it. So, 